i and how you all today the question says evaluate limit x approach is 0 x stand 4x upon 1 minus cos 4x now let us quickly solve the given question now here rewriting the given limit once again we have now it equal to limit x approaches 0 x tan 4x upon now here we can write 1 minus cos 4x as 2 sine square 2x isn't it because 1 minus cos 2x or let's take it as theta here is equal to 2 sine square theta. Okay. Now this is further equal to limit x approaches 0. Now we are separating out our numerator in this form. We have tan 4x upon 4x. So we will multiply it by 4x also into x by 2 into 4x square upon sine square 2x into 1 upon 4x square. So we have limit x approaches 0 tan 4x upon 4x into This 4x square will get cancelled out with this 4x square. So we have 1 by 2 into. Now we can write this whole term as 2x upon sine 2x the whole square. So now I'm separating out the limit we have 1 by 2 into limit when x approaches to 0 then 4x also approaches to 0. So we have limit 4x approaching 0 tan 4x upon 4x into limit when x approaches 0 then 2x also approach to 0. So we have limit 2x approaching 0 2x upon sine 2x into this is whole square. So again we have limit 2x approaches 0. 2x upon sine 2x. Now in using the limit we have 1 by 2. This whole term will become equal to exactly 1 into 1 into 1. This is because limit x approaches 0 the value of tan x upon x is equal to limit x approaches 0 sin x upon x is equal to 1. Right? So we have the answer to this question as that is answer to this limit as 1 by Right. So this completes the session. Hope you understood it well and enjoyed it too. Have a nice day.